Seniors, now that you have accepted admission to your college or university of your choice, I recommend that you send a notification of non-acceptance declining enrollment at each of your other colleges that accepted you for admission. This should just be a short email addressed to each of the colleges that accepted you, but you are not going to attend next fall. Besides being the courteous thing to do, it is important to send notices of non-acceptance because many colleges that receive courteous notifications keep students' records on file for one year. This includes students' admission status and their offers of financial aid. This means if you discover this coming fall you really don't like the college you're attending and wish you had enrolled in another college, the admission doors to those other colleges may still be open without having to submit any application materials. Upon request, the other colleges may automatically admit you as a transfer student in the spring or fall of 2022. Furthermore, as a transfer student, your colleges may honor the financial aid offered to you in spring 2021 and may apply that aid to your sophomore, junior, and senior years. Notifications should just be a brief email to that college admission counselor handling your file at each of your other colleges and should express appreciation for being considered worthy of admission and thank the school for accepting you. If you don't have the email address for a particular college admission counselor, send the email to the admissions office. Such an email should include the date with a salutation of Dear Admissions Counselor or the name of the counselor, with a body of the email stating something like, I am writing to inform you that I will not be attending your school in the coming fall. Instead, I will be attending another university, but would like to thank you for the honor of admission to your school. I wish you and your university continued great success. Thank you again, sincerely, and then put your name, date of birth, student ID number, either the common app ID or the college provided ID, and send that on to the college admission counselor or admissions office. My advice is to remain on good terms with the other colleges that accepted you for admission and take time to send a short email expressing your appreciation for considering you worthy of admission.